I am always thrilled to tell the stories of those who helped us to be who and what we are. That's history, and we say black history, but it's really American history. Sue Roseberry has been a part of the Midland Storytelling Festival since its origin in 1992. And just three years ago, it expanded to highlight stories of black culture. I think that it's becoming something that people throughout our community of all races enjoys, and they get a chance to come to this beautiful museum and hear music and experience a cultural expression in a way that they don't get to enjoy every day. The festival included spoken word by international story performer Buffalo Bobby skin. Norfolk. If you want a kicking pie, no, don't use Bobby and storytelling through song <laughs> by the West Texas chapter of the Gospel Music Workshop of America. It was a breath of fresh air to hear the gospel choir, to hear what Bobby's words were, and to talk about um, our history and um, how inclusive it really can be and what the differences are and, and how we're similar too. Mary Marshall is the Director of Development for the Museum of the Southwest, and she says the museum works diligently to provide opportunities like this festival to the residents of Midland. We pride ourselves um, at the museum on having something for everyone, and this is one of the ways that we can do that. You know, um, art, culture, science, and history is something that is a part of our mission at the museum, and by having uh, stories passed down, that's a part of our history, it's a part of our culture, and that's um, a really, truly an art in and of itself that we don't want to see be lost. Sue is very passionate about sharing African American stories and history. Her words of wisdom are that the community embraces all the festival has to offer. My favorite part is watching the faces of people as they engage with the participants because we already kind of anticipate what they're going to do, but seeing the audience grab a hold of it and how it resonates with them is the best part. Every culture is unique, and there is always room for people to celebrate one with another. In Midland, I'm Sydney Jolivet, News West 9.